now, my last guest, if he's still awake, I think he's probably awake. <laughs> He is the star of some major league Nickelodeon shows. I got to work with him on several live action versions of The Fairly Odd Parents as well. He played the live action Timmy Turner, but you, know, you might know him as the star of Drake and Josh. Mr. Drake Bell! Yeah! Take off. That's all the applause, Drake Bell. Yeah! yeah. Time out of his rock and roll schedule to come here today. It's very rock and roll. Thank you. And Drake's holding two microphones like everybody else. He's being a real champion. Thank you. Yeah. And he's the only one. But you've, got, you've got more tattoos than you had last time I saw you. I probably do. I've yeah. got a few. Yeah, yeah, yeah I do. I exactly. do a lot now, yeah. And we haven't seen each other for quite some time, like maybe three or four years. Is it that long? I think it's been that long. Oh, wow. I've been yeah. counting the minutes. Wow. wow. <laughs> yeah. I think the last time I saw you was when I auditioned for Bunsen. Uh, is it B? What's the name of the show? What? <laughs> it's my least successful I didn't, show. I didn't book it, so. Yeah, I know. Didn't uh, book my it. My least successful yeah. show, and uh, Jeremy, Jeremy's the star of it. <laughs> Yeah, he's, oh, he got it? He got it. Oh. <laughs> Dope. Congrats, bro. Did you, it was awkward earlier when he was mocking your audition. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I did. I came in. I was like, hey, everybody. I'm Bunsen. How's it going, everybody? Hey. <laughs> so you're doing cartoon voices now, though, right? Who do you do on cartoons? Oh, like, like Spider-Man <laughs> stuff. Spider-Man. Whoa. 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 Yeah, I do the voice of Ultimate Spider-Man and then a bunch of others. Stuff at Spider-Man school. Is Very cool. And you were Pent Ultimate Spider-Man? Yeah, it's Ultimate. Pent Ultimate. Pent Ultimate. Yeah. Pent Ultimate. Oh, Second Pent to last one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Um, so did you, uh, now you're a huge Disney fan though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Disney fan. Yeah. Like, and you go to Disneyland how many times like a month? I actually saw you at Disneyland the other day. Uh -huh. um, I go a lot. I went, I went, I checked my pass. I go, I went 190 times last year. Wow. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, I go a lot. It's, I don't know. We're at Nickelodeon. Are we allowed to talk about it? <laughs> he brought it up. So. Do, do they have a tattoo parlor there? Now? <laughs> <laughs> so you know, they actually so get them done. They actually do. Yeah. They're so, very good. Yeah. <laughs> and they remodeled that Tower of Terror. They threw one in the lobby. Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> Gee, I hope you have an annual pass. It's very expensive. <laughs> That's a drink ball cash kind of buys you. You can go to Disneyland as much as you want. That's really cool. You use I your wish. Powers for good. I wish. What's your favorite part of Disneyland? My favorite part of Disneyland? Oh, uh, I don't know. Main Street? I don't know. You love Main Street? Yeah, just the nostalgia of everything. I love go you know, like the stuff that's unchanged. Mm. It's kind of I like this guy. I like the, I like uh, Main Street because they, they change don't they change the window displays like every like day. Dude, the window displays right now are so sick. Have you seen the new ones that change? Like, I have the, not been there for Christmas. No. Who's been there for Christmas? Has anybody been there? Dude, yeah, they yeah. are so awesome. They take they have like a Toy Story window. They have a, a, a Princess and the Frog window, and they're just you, you have to see them to, to be able to understand what they do. But they're they're like animated. And but they're, they and they they move and change scenery. So Disney does animation. Is that what I'm trying to do? Something you've never seen before. Oh my God! Yeah, you're not familiar with it at all. I'm not really. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. So Which um, does not understand animation. <laughs> I don't want to pick fences. Well, you know what that is. So wait. So okay. So you like Disneyland and and um, Drake and Josh. Um, and how long did Drake and Josh go? Drake and Josh went for. Uh, four seasons. You guys watch Drake and Josh? Drake and Josh, I, I was surprised because my girls were very little and they watched it. I, and I'm like, oh, it's just this show they watch. It was hilarious. Thank you guys you. were hilarious. Thank you. Seriously. Yeah, what, what trips me out is uh, how, many, how many episodes of Carly did you guys do? Well, and Jerry was on all of them. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I was there for I mean, like six months. No big deal. <laughs> <laughs> it was like over 100, right? Did you guys get yeah, it? Yeah, I guess. You did yeah, over 100. Yeah. You did over 100, yeah. And Drake and Josh, we only did 56 episodes. Really? Yeah, it's crazy because our first season was so short, and then, but for some reason, it's just like taking on a... Well, because didn't they, they thought like a competing show was going to be a big hit. Yeah. So, so they really, Drake and Josh was like the huge hit. So they ordered not that Because it Dan's first show. Right. And so they, didn't, they weren't sure if he was going to be able to step out on his own and be able to do it, you know. And they only did six episodes for the first season. Mm, that's right. And then, so, so yeah, so we, and every time they would go to re up, they'd be like, ah, oh, we'll get 13, or, you know, so we only did a couple of them. Guy Carly's be like, all right, we're gonna do, you know, 26, we're gonna do another this. But, uh, but yeah, it's just so cool that it's taken on such a life and 
people think that we've done hundreds and hundreds of episodes and season after season. They're like, you've watched the same episode. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 And you work with Jerry Trainer. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. And, and actually, we just, I just, we just finished a movie uh, called uh, Cover Versions too. We have to work together. Very good. Where can we see Cover Versions? It's from Palm Springs. That's Palm Springs film. In January. In January. Yeah. Who's gonna go see that? I'm gonna go see it. Yeah, check it out. Yeah. Yeah. Ryan's in it and Kitty Cassidy and Austin Swift, Taylor's brother. Is it a comedy or is it like a drama? Is it a thriller? Uh, I would say dramedy. Okay. It's like, a, it's like an indie noir. Yeah, it's like indie noir. It's about it's about rock and roll and murder. Did yeah. Jerry get killed? I not don't. I can't. Yeah, I can't say really what happened. All right. All right. Yeah. So Drake, it's, it's fun. It's rock and roll. And, you know. Drake's, Drake's the comedy, and Jerry's the unintentional tragedy. <laughs> 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 Jerry's got plutonium. <laughs> we're we're going to tell you <laughs> in the movie too. He doesn't have pants. <laughs> in the movie. He wears pants. Wow. So disturbing. Hey, we when we did um, uh, the third Fairly Odd Parents. Um, uh, live action movies. Uh, uh, he played the live action Timmy Turner. I think he's a far better looking Timmy Turner than the real Timmy Turner. But uh, we were in Hawaii and um, I'm just glad he grew into his teeth. Exactly. I know. We're, we're, we're debating. We really yeah. were debating. We give him the buck teeth. <laughs> it's not going to work with the buck teeth in real life. But we were like, uh, we were in this hotel we're having dinner and they were having a talent contest in the hotel. And they were like, uh, winner gets a free trip back to the hotel. This is like on Maui somewhere, right? And uh, so uh, Drake, uh, it's supposed to be for the guests of the hotel, not professional musicians. So Drake gets, up and, <laughs> Drake gets up and shreds guitar, wins the contest, and gets the trip back to the hotel. Yeah. Dude, my favorite story about doing Fairly Odd Parents, the third one, was the second one was a Christmas uh, movie. movie. Yeah. And... We were up on the top. And Darren was in that movie too. We were up on the. Top. I was in all three of those movies. <laughs> <laughs> Not that you want to mention it. All right, right. memorable <laughs> performances, obviously. Golly gee, I wonder who played Timmy Turner's dad in all three films. I, I wrote I all three movies. Just I know. Escapes the mind. Escapes the mind. <laughs> yeah, and when he said uh, Darren was in that one, it sounded like he was surprised he remembered. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Darren was in that one. <laughs> Hotel. You were the, the Welcome to Memorable Performances with Darren. <laughs> yeah, we were. Darren, when did you get here? I'm glad. We were telling a story. It took me a long time to get a job. Uh, Darren gets a lot, and everyone just immediately forgets that he's good. That's right, man. I, just, I slide in that mediocrity scale, and everybody forgets about me. It's all good. I just keep working. But it's steady, so you know. It's, it's the memento of that place. So we're up on the top of a mountain. We're freezing cold. It's you know we're, we're in the North Pole. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're, yeah, we're in in Canada, and you know we have to do all of our dialogue and look like we're not cold and we're we're, we're shivering. And, and, and Butch keeps making the joke. Don't worry, guys. The next one we're gonna shoot in Hawaii. Don't worry. The next yeah. one we're gonna shoot in Hawaii. Like, yeah, okay, ha ha, we get it. You're in the tent with the heater and, and the monitors and everything. It's like funny the first time. And so, so when uh, I got the call about the third one, I said, oh, you're not going to believe this, uh, but we're, they're going to be shooting in Hawaii. <laughs> and I said, dude, they got you in on the joke too? Like, it's, uh, we get it. And he's like, no, 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 they're really shooting in Hawaii. I don't know what you're talking about. I said, what? And so I called Butch. I said, what are you talking We're shooting in Hawaii. He said, I opened my laptop. I said, fade in Hawaii. <laughs> and I didn't know what was coming after that, but I just knew I was getting us to Hawaii. Yeah, we did. So, and, 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 and we did it. And, and yeah. Exactly. And so we got to shoot the third one in, in, uh, in Hawaii. And it was the most amazing experience of shooting a movie that I've ever had. It was really great. Very good. It was a lot of fun. And, um, and then was, the thing that was the worst part about that was the fact we knew it was going to end. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to end. Well, I didn't leave. I stayed. I kept getting text messages from everyone going, the movie's over. Go home. I go, I'm not. I'm still at, I'm still at Turtle Bay. Like, you're not. still there. They're looking at my Instagram. They're like, it's been three weeks. <laughs> if you, you kept winning. Bay, if you went to Turtle Bay, you would know yeah, why you you're can't there. He kept yeah, winning yeah. more. <laughs> More hotel stays. <laughs> yeah, I just, I just kept going to the contest. Were they picking up the contest? Kept me there. Man. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, so I lived on that for a while. And, 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 and where can, where can, where can people now. find you now? If they want to like look for Drake Bell, where do they find Drake Bell? Uh, on, I don't know. Disneyland. Disneyland. Yeah, yeah. Disneyland. Actually, that's, you, you are quite But possible. you're on tour, though, a lot. You yeah, I'm on tour. I'm, I, I'm going on tour. I just got off tour Ugh. Uh, for like seven weeks all over the country, and we did a lot of Latin America days. We were all over Mexico, and 
Um, and then in January, I'll be going to like Argentina and Brazil and uh, uh, a lot of other canters. <laughs> we'll be to We're actually sponsored by canters. <laughs> yeah, that's one of our sponsors, which is really, really awesome. Um, so we, <laughs> we, um, but yeah, so just all over social media, you know, Insta Instagram and Twitter and Facebook and all that stuff. You can check out the dates and stuff. We'll be, we'll be going out in, uh, in January. I just finished some mu music videos and have a new record out and all this stuff. So I'm really working on Very cool. Stuff. Very cool. Yeah. Give it up for Drake Bell, everybody. <laughs>Hey, Heart fans, subscribe here to keep up with me, Danny, Timmy, Dudley, Bunsen, and the Noob Network, my new app full of cartoons, shows, and games. Download it here. Click over here to watch my most recent video and here to start a playlist related to this video. Whoa, check out that awesome fan art. To be featured here, use hashtag heartfanart and tag me. I'm on every social media platform known to man. Cartoon Butch out. Pencil drop.